Elevator Mountain Hill. This is back with some E4 playing Mahikan. And I'm attempting to, like, try and annex these guys. But they're just not letting me because they're just a bit too shy. It's so annoying. Let's get them freaking subsidies or something. I'm going to love me a bit more. So that'll get me Tech 12, which would be Combat Whip, Slander Merchants. Very good. Come on, my guy. I don't want to do that just yet. I don't think I want to do looking beyond just yet. And we want to think about attacking these guys as soon as we hit Tech 11 and 76. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to do it. We're going to kick some butt. Take them upstairs. Slap him around a little bit. City Senator leaves furious. Bribe him. Bribe him. Sadly, we are completely and totally out of manpower. It's really, really annoying. We do have 10 favors, however. Perhaps we can trade favors for soldiers. That might not be the worst thing ever. And the Daki War. Hey, they did it. We also think maybe you should try to get more favors. I'm just trying to keep an eye on Europe as well, because, oh, the god, England's just taken over Scotland. Henry is shooter the 11th. All right, Terra is now done. Which is nice. Um, I'll wait for that to be finished. I'm going to try and grab Greenland then. One of these ones, anyway. Let's take this one. It'll be fun to have Greenland, I think. It'll be an adventure. Alright, where's my fleet? Let's go get them. Alright. We can do this. Obviously, we still need to get a lot more colonizations underway. Or we can really even think about certain things, which is annoying. But such it is. Still need to have the Hippodrome. That's almost done, actually, so that's going to be great. And the Ducky War ends. Wow, good job. Almost immediately. Death of a Merchant. So we had tier 3 would be 50% cheaper. Or unrest. It would be a free point, or it could be money. I will take the free point. That's worth it. Free admin points, man. No wrong, with nothing, no wrong answer there. Okay. Let's just send a couple hundred more men. Might as well. Alright. Low corruption, wow. Okay. So, with low corruption, we could actually get some money. Let's do that. That's gonna go down real fast. Oh my god, Huron has just destroyed everybody. Oh my god, didn't see that happening. Good. Stop relation improvement. Cancel subsidies. There you go. How long will that take? Oh my god, only three years. Very nice. Oh my god, they're actually very strong. This one could still be done. It would give us just trade range and trade ship power. It's not that great. Sadly, we are completely lacking a certain thing here. Okay. Doesn't look like there's much opportunity for us to grab much other claims. 
It's a bit annoying, but we'll make it work. And we've got a lot of money now. I think just building as many buildings as possible is going to be a good shout. Because we need manpower. Oh my goodness, we do. I just realized, should we be increasing our entropy? Could be. Why do I not remember how to do this? There it is. Oh, I don't have enough development. Never mind. That's fine. I might do this, though. That would actually give us even more. But it's only trade power. It's not that valuable. Okay. Getting so close to spreading this. Come on now. Get that. Good, good, good. And reform the Hellenic faith. Oh my god, we're going to do it. It lacks focus and centralized tenants. The reformation of the Hellenic faith. Finally. While the Hellenic pantheon is the official subject of worship of our nation, there remains a dissent among our clergy and citizenry regarding which Olympians should be primarily addressed and worshipped. Philosophers, scholars, laymen, and courtiers alike have made the argument that like our predecessors in Athens, Sparta, or Thebes, we too should dedicate ourselves to a single collection of deities. Okay. Out of all of the slats... Oh, my ears... My hearing just went. That was weird. Out of all the suggestions, the three choices appear to be the most pertinent. Zeus, king of the earth and of Olympus. Poseidon, lord of the sea and of Atlantis. And Apollo, god of sun and of beauty. We shall worship Zeus. Zeus worship yearly army tradition decay. Abandon our current set of deities. And get a new one. Oh my god. That is cool. But I lose this the global settler increase. Which is really annoying. Well, trade power is pretty good. Armatrician and tech toss is nice too. Mm, it's kind of lame. Poseidon is naval force limit and yearly naval tradition. Cavalry combat ability. Ooh! Global settler increase 30. That's just... Oh, it's just double. That's just double what I have now. Okay, okay. And then I've got other things as well. Hmm... Some of these are really interesting. The next one's Apollo. Monarch lifespan plus 20%. Dionysius gives war exhaustion as well with goods produced. And Orpheus, 15% diff annex costs with power protection from insult. So I can just insult people like crazy while diplomatically annexing people as well. Which is insane. And core creation costs from Perseus. Or I can keep my current set and get true to intolerance of true faith. Which is really just a bunch of kind of lamer versions, but... So if I do this one, I will lose my global settler increase of 15 forever. But... Actually, to be honest, I don't really like any of these other than the tech cost. I think Apollo is possibly the most coolest one. Let's go Apollo. That's so cool. I like that a lot. All right, carry on. I'm just going to randomly get Greenland because I think it'll be funny. I think it'll be a meme worthy. So this is being annexed. Oh, you know what? No, hang on. I think it might be worth it trying to update the dev here. Let's get local dev costs. There you go. Ba, 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 ba. Good. It helps a little bit with the dev cost. Our plates in the sun. Oh no. Does this mean that they now border us somewhere? God, they're still Catholic. What can we get here? Ooh, 50% AE, 200% 80% cost for all New World provinces 
monetary annulment. Oh, that's great. That's really good. Unfortunately, I will never be able to do that because they will slap me upside down and all around. So no thank you. I think it might be worth devving up a few provinces. Here and there. This growing business goods produce no. Oh, these all have local development cost reductions. Great. Let's just spend all these points. Heck yeah. Why not, right? Oh yeah. That's the stuff. There we go. It just increases my tax base. It makes me more powerful. We gotta... We gotta kick this guy's butt. I think. It's the only way. It's the only way. We also have Onetta here. And that'll call in everybody. Ah! Everyone is really starting to combine up, aren't they? Oh. Oh, they're getting so strong. Okay, so if I take this one, I call in them, Eskikwe, Beichen, and Crete. So I actually don't care about that. So I think the next one is going to be these nerds. Problem is, I'm still below on tech. Pretty badly. Okay. We gotta start making a move here. Get a little royal marriage. Ah, uh, come on, don't be like that. Let's get an ability. Let's get prestige for development. Let's do that. That'll help. Looks like Huron is donezo. And that colony's gone. So, uh, yeah. So, now I won't have anyone for whom I can give stuff to. I have to be Huron. Yeah, it's gonna have to be Huron. About to vassalize Huron, and they'll become my lads. Oh, we need so much more manpower. Just sit quietly, boys. Sit quietly and pray. Pray, I say. Problem is, we really need to wait for radical sympathizers to go down. We need the Barbarii Council to, to piss off already. Is there anything that'll make them more likely to be happy? Jesus. I just need... Every province gets minimum autonomy and province governing cost. Ah, that would kill me. Increase tribute, no. Open offices, no. Designate development zones. Every province... Oh my god, the modifier is so unpleasant. This is going to make I lose all my manpower modifier. Jesus. We'll seize 5% of their lands. They lose 20 loyalty. Okay. Not too bad. How much land do they have? You know what? I think I'm going to have to go for inclusive citizenship. I know it's a lot, but I think it's all I have to do. So then they're going to get to... Because I need to get them to the correct amount here. 
<gasps> Mission. Yes, wonders of Elysium. At long last. In the old world, they had great monuments. A thousand temples, a thousand columns. All left in the hands of barbaric hordes and decadent nobles. Even such a major setback has not stopped our architects, engineers, and thinkers who are drafting new plans or even greater wonders to last us another thousand years. Yes. 100 splendor, prestige, and construction time. Ah. Uh, brilliant. Rich as hell. I love it. Next up. Cost goes down by 10 every 5 years to a minimum of 20. Implement the old Byzantine model. Oh, gross. Oh, I'd lose Greek fire core. Oh, no, 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 no. Never mind, never mind. Gross, gross, gross. Didn't want to do that. No, thank you. All right. We're annexing vessels. We're doing great. Can't do much. Okay, so the Hippodrome can be upgraded, and that would give us cavalry cost and cavalry combat ability. Or we can get the Grand Cothan. I think I'd rather for the Grand Library, thank you. Oh man, that costs a lot of Diplo points. Yes, let's go. Yes, that equilibrium. Circulation of hostile publications. Don't care. Good. Good, good, good. Judy of Tostoy's. The sole domain. That's going to be a no, my friend. You, you are not welcome, my lad. You are not welcome. We need to start pushing in and taking Muskegee. And we need to take it soon. Copper struck in Athea. Let's take a look at what Athea is. It's currently naval supplies. Hooray! The Guardian Seagates. Morale of armies, yearly prestige, and merchant trade power. I'm going to prioritize the Grand Alexandria Library. Because it will massively increase my reduce my advisor costs. And institution spread and tech costs, please. Oh, thank you. Okay. Let's do that. I'm ready. The Grand Race, the Hippodrome. Red versus blue, the top players last few years. Bets can be placed on individuals. Both teams have asked for the Emperor's blessing. Put a bet. All right, blue team. Blue team, blue team. My team was defeated. Oh. Okay. Not cool. All right. This is exciting. I'm very pleased with this. These little developments. Going nicely. Musket or bow? Mill tech costs. Or lose army tradition. What? No. You are not permitted such things. Stop that. Still spreading very slowly. Alright. Come on, buddy. Oh, you are taking a while. Let's try that, shall we? Panamas is now self-sustaining. So I have to colonize this because of the freaking... Let's do that then. Because of the damn mission tree. That's okay. We will grab Panama, slowly but surely. I will make that a state, actually, because I probably will want it as a state. Popular Noble, dip reputation. Oh my god, come on. Taking so long to annex. Please. Okay. 
Come here, All right, in the next episode, we're going to continue to get... Oh, damn it. We're going to continue to get further cool stuff. Uh, further claims on Muskogee until we can have as many as possible, and then we attack them. Uh, let them go, it's fine. We attack them, giving as much to Kachoki and taking as much of the Eastern Rim as possible. Yes, as much as we can. We're also going to attack Huron to vassalize them as soon as the truce is up after that point. Oh, good. Well, maybe not. And we're going to continue to finish this colonization and then continue colonizing further inland. I was Aldrahim, I continue to be, and I will see you next episode. Bye bye.